Hi everybody, I'm Chris from Balloons Online. Today we are on site inflating a lot of balloons, specifically uh, a lot of cloud busters, and I thought it'd be a great opportunity to show you how we inflate the cloud busters. Um, but we've done that before actually, but also to show you how we tie the cloud busters. Quite a lot of people are asking that question, and um, there's, there's a lot of ways to do it, but we'll show you one method. So we'll start with, um, it's got a 5.5 foot cloud buster. We um, don't ever really inflate to full size. So um, I usually take about 10% off. We've got here 1.5 meters, which is um, five foot. Uh, from base plates, just with our um, vertical rods. So when we inflate the balloon, it stops between the, uh, the two rods. So let's get going. Now you may or, not, may or may not have seen these um, little Makita leaf blowers. Uh, they're just the business. I've done a little video on that before. It inflates the balloon so much faster than anything else, and the great thing about it is being portable. We, I first bought this when I was doing a lot of work around pools, and I didn't want um, 240 volt electricity um, extension cords around the pool, but uh, we've got a couple of these now, and it's pretty much all we use. So it slots on quite well over the flexible nozzle. <laughs> So what I'm looking for is, as it gets bigger and bigger, I'm going to touch it to one side, to one pole, and I'm just going to look at the other side. So if you don't have two poles and two base plates, you can use two chairs, you can use a, a helium tank up against a wall or, or whatever works. But uh, so this is the part that uh, we get a lot of questions is how to now tie the cloud buster now it's inflated. So this is my method, it just worked it out and I'm sure there's many other ways that could be better. But firstly what I do is I twist the neck of the cloud buster and at this point you get your line, in, in this case we've just got little cuts, pull that through, just leave it there hanging and now I'll pull it up a little higher. And now I'm going to fold the neck of the balloon around the original twist, okay? So I've brought the flat down, I've folded it around, and at this point, we get our cable ties. And a bit hard with two hands. And just pull it in absolutely as tight as you can. And we've got these little cable tie cutters, and, and they also add a little bit of uh, force on that cable tie. So we pull it and it pushes and cuts. And now, this line here will tie it off a couple of knots. And that eventually will tie onto the structure that we've got up there. Cool. I hope you've enjoyed. Have a great day.